What we did over here is we shielded it a little bit. So what we can do, you can use these papers. You can just dump the water out and start over. That's fine. Uh, don't put it where the papers are. Just throw it in the grass. It's all right. All right, come here. You're going to hold yours right here. We are measuring calories in food. We have a homemade cal calometer. And what we do is we take the food and put it on the little gradient, heat it up, and with the heat, you have the energy from the heat, and that's how we get our food, is energy, we need it for calories. And we measure it on up, and we change, take the temperature change. So the initial temperature minus the final temperature gives us how much the heat that was generated from the food, i.e. how much calories we have. Well, really, honestly, the, the reason that we developed the camp was so that students would be exposed. Um, we know that if we look at our nation, we look at our nation as compared to other nations, we recognize where we are with science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. We recognize how important that is. Um, we look at our scores, and science was an area that we've done okay in, but not as well as we should be doing. And so when we look at the need, and we know that that's the future, and it's going to really be what determines what kind of nation we are in terms of comparison to other nations, we have got to move our students into this area. Um, and then sometimes it's just, you know, we got light a fire. We've got to ignite something. We have to excite them. Well, uh, we heard it was uh, it was a lot of fun, and they get to learn all a lot of stuff here, and uh, especially science uh, stuff. It's he's like very uh, scientific, I guess, oriented, and uh, he likes it so far. Um, I felt that it would give her a chance to explore other options and to see what she liked, and um, if it's something that she really likes, that we could possibly see into getting her into more things like that. We felt like in fourth, fifth grade, they've got a little bit of maybe some background knowledge, and then from fourth and fifth grade, they're able to kind of do things on their own, and, um, and then all the way through middle school, and really focusing on that group. Not to say, again, there aren't things that we can do with other groups, but that was our target group for this time. So I'm just excited about what they're learning and what they're doing and what they come up with. Things that we wouldn't think about. They really think outside the box. Um, so giving them that opportunity to do so.